everyone this is crafty decoria and i hope you're all doing great i have a quick dollar tree haul to share with all of you as usual here is an overview of the things that i picked up i will go through them one by one so that you can have a better look i hope you enjoy so yesterday when i entered the dollar tree i was hungry and i always remind myself that i should eat before i get in there because I end up picking up little goodies to bring home but these were new things that I saw and so I thought I would give them a try so the first thing I picked up is this wild rice works gourmet rice snacks it's sea salt and black sesame it looked really interesting and I thought it would be really a yummy little snack to try it is gluten free and it is 155 grams inside of the bag. So, um, what else does it say here? Gluten free, whole grain rice, cholesterol free, and zero trans fat. So, I thought I'd give that a try. I've been noticing they've been getting a lot of Bear Paw products, and this one is new. It says made with real fruits and veggies. And it is a uh, white cheddar uh, bake snack mix. So there are crackers. So they have um, this type of cracker here, pretzels, and then white cheddar. And I did try these and they're really good. They are peanut free and the size of this is 135 grams. I also tried this as I do love dark chocolate and pumpkin seeds. So when I saw this, I thought it would be a tasty treat to try and I really liked it. The only thing is you can see in the picture that it shows quite a lot of pumpkin seeds where when I had the actual piece, there was not that many, but it was really good. So it is made thin dark chocolate pumpkin seeds with sea salt no cholesterol and the size of this package is 50 grams but i did really like them though and then the last goodie here are these lady sarah swirls marshmallow and they are strawberry and vanilla flavored so i thought i would give these a try and i have my daughter to the side of me who looks like she wants to open the bag right now so we'll give these a try and see how they are they look really good though i saw that they are starting to bring out their hats and scarves and i came across these two um, the first is a headband a knitted headband and it had a little opening in it and then I was able to read the tag so it's actually a Dove product so it's a hundred percent acrylic and I thought that looked really cute and would be nice for the fall and winter I came across this hat which looks like the work socks and I thought it was super cute and it seems you know not too heavy yet warm enough it is a knit hat and it has a pom-pom on the top so I thought those were really cute I had seen a Dollar Tree haul where Dollar Tree came out with some new dog toys and they were food items and luckily I was able to find this single pizza slice with the knotted rope here on the end but that was all I was able to find and these are by um, Green Bear G K C Kennel Club and it is a squeaky toy so at least I was able to find this one I don't know how well it's gonna hold up Dollar Tree dog toys don't usually hold up too well other than the um, I have hauled it a couple times it is a rope and it has the two balls on each end and that one really seemed to hold up pretty good with my puppy well he's nine months now and when he first did um, get them they were lasting a little bit longer but he is actually biting more into them right now so as always with any toy you just have to really supervise your puppy especially if they are um, if they do bite a lot 
but um, at least for a little bit. If it lasts for a little bit, it's just a new toy um, and treat for him to play with. So I thought I was pretty happy and lucky to at least get this pizza slice. And then I came across this again. I don't know if this was already out there and I just never noticed it, but I was really happy to come across this Betty Crocker, Betty Crocker avocado tool. And I love avocados. They are one of my favorite things. So this avocado tool features and care it says three in one tool, halves, pits, and slices built-in skin cutter slices and halves the avocado gray spikes help to twist and lift out pit multiple blades easily cut perfect avocado slices comfortable non-slip handle and dishwasher safe so i was really happy to come across this cool little gadget so a decor item that i've picked up before but I did see that they had only one more of these and this is one of my favorites. The tractor on top with the Farm Fresh little box sign underneath. So I thought it was meant for me to bring it home. And now I can add this to the other ones that I have. I don't know if I'm going to do anything with these. I just really like decorating or using these as decor in smaller spaces on tiered trays or in my RV because, you know, RVs are, at least mine, have a lot of small spaces and these are perfect to add some really nice decor. I finally came across the ceramic houses. And I can't remember if there was more than two, um, but these are the the uh, tea light candle holders, and there were only four, so I just picked up the two, one of each. So this one here says Home Sweet Home, which is really cute, and then the shorter but wider house that says Welcome. So I'm really happy to finally have been able to come across these at Dollar Tree and then in that same aisle they've been coming out with a lot of foam uh, pieces uh, by Craft Medley and these are the foam numbers and you get 10 pieces in a package so I thought these were pretty cute I picked up a pack not sure what I'm gonna do with them yet but I'm pretty sure I'll be able to use them in some DIY so Dollar Tree has been bringing out their winter Christmas items. Now I only did get to the one Dollar Tree and it's not the absolute favorite of the four Dollar Trees that I go to, but it was the only one that I was able to get to this weekend. And so for seasonal, I only picked up what you see in front of me here. The first for fall, I picked up these tumblers, which I think are so pretty. It is like a deep red and it has the gold uh, writing that spells out fall and then the gold pumpkins. I thought was really, really pretty. So I picked up a couple of those. I also picked up this wooden decor piece and these are by Green Briar International. And they, it's very similar to the like haunted house wooden, um, I guess DIY wooden decor piece. I'm not exactly sure what you call this, but uh, this is the winter version of it. Um, and I think it is so pretty. So you can see that the snow on top of the roof is thicker there and the windows are the same and then they have drawn in the trees the door and then the lights there really pretty for some fun DIYs hopefully I get around to making something with this I just thought it was so so pretty and the last item to show you for this Dollar Tree haul was the item that I was on the lookout for and I was very fortunate to find them at this Dollar Tree. Now they did not have the oven mitt holders, the pot holders, the uh, tea towels, none of that stuff. And especially I also saw the ceramic little containers that were in the buffalo check and i believe it said blessed not 100 percent sure 
um, but I was on the lookout for those as well and was not able to find those but I did find the plates and was very happy they only had eight of the larger plates was it which was exactly what I needed so I did pick up eight of the larger plates and then they had quite a few of the smaller plates and they do come with three different sayings so the first here says blessed they have faith and then the last one is cherish and I was again super excited to come across these and bring them home well guys that'll do it it wasn't a huge haul but I did find my plates which I wanted to share for any of you who are in Canada if you haven't had them arrive at your Dollar Tree then possibly they will be arriving very soon and I again was really happy to bring them home I hope you are all doing well I hope that you are all safe and healthy I hope that you like this little haul if you did please give it a thumbs up share the video if you can it greatly helps my channel and if you haven't subscribed to my channel I would absolutely love and appreciate it if you did as always guys you take care of yourselves and I hope to catch you in my next video bye bye Thank you.